Look like better than usual. Well, I bathe just for you. I'm being genuine, Bill. Been waiting for you, Arthur. Well, I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the Greys over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job, needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them, and they're paying. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Now come on. This seem legit to you, Bill? Sure. Dutch said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? Yeah. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. And what are they bored in their fields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, that's so. Yeah. They think it was the Braithwaite's. Listen, I know these Grey Boys a bit now. This is on the level. We're stuck in the middle of some ancient feud. But instead of playing both sides, we're being used by both of them. They were saying the Catherine Braithwaite. Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Now it don't feel right. I could have told you. <laughs> Happy Morgan. Do you see that window and don't talk to me about slap. Better in here, not there. to be sooner. See that? Those cowards are running away. Looks like most of them. Not all of them. Sure. Bray. And what about Bill? Where the hell's he? We'll find him later. Come on. Sheriff Gray! You need to get a hold on this town. It's going to hell. Who do you think you are? Why don't 
wretched two-bit thugs from God knows where? You're so dumb to think we don't know what you've been doing. Come out, Sheriff. It's over. We put down far worse than you a hundred times over. This is the Grays town. Always has been, always will be. Only Grays I see left around here is you. You want us to come out? We'll come out. Get. Oh, Bill. Guns on the ground now. Both of you. Don't do it. You know we can't do that. You put the gun down, Sheriff. I'll blow his brains out. You want to join your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dead man. Morgan? How the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. He was out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out. Except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what, six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Bury him proper someplace quiet. <clears throat> Maka? Best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. He was like an annoying little brother to me. What fun we had riding together. What a goddamn mess we are making of things. Yep.
want to get a drink. I'm parched. <laughs> Kids or tails where I'm at. <laughs> I live in front of the saloon next to the freight station. You know if I'm heading in the right direction. Sure, sure. Just head over that way. You'll get home fine. Thank you, mister. Certainly do appreciate it. Certainly. Good evening, mister. Been a while since you came through town, ain't it? Have a look around. Now, let me have a look. All yours. Seem to have your eye on that. Keep looking. Let me know if there's anything else. Come back again. Get off me! Yeah, welcome. So, what are you aiming for today? Well, let me know what you want. I'll bring it out. Let me in, woman! You can go ahead and sleep it off. Got what I need. They should have called better. this dump Turd Town. Now I that is some serious underground up top so there, Brent. Oh, even right. the wolves. What can I do for you? The only thing to drink is fresh blood. Now, all about churches and shops and all this other bullshit. America, you're toast. How long are you going to keep this up? What's up front's just as important as what's on top. What kind of men are you? Hmm? This here's a cut for a stand-no-nonsense man. Whiners. Complainers. Ugh. I had a complainer once. And now West of... On the trail of Lanahassee in 68, we sold his labor to the engines, and then we ate him when it got cold. And I'll tell you what, he tasted like shit, which was only about right, because he was a turd of a man. God damn, turd. Taking off. Damn near breaks my But whatever the customer here. wants. We don't want you here. This place was for real men. 
men who could drink, men who could fight. Instead, we got men who could work this good. I ought to up my prices. Men who like politics and farmers. Girls don't need men. no more farmers. Farmers ain't men. They just guard Thank you. Too many yeah, that looks paid. good. Too many goddamn women around here. That's pretty decent. Better than you hoped, I bet. People ask where you got it, you be sure to tell them. Partner. Okay. Guess we're about Watch yourself. And tell your friends. Ready and able. Let me see. Bye, Thanks for your assistance. Time to go, boy.
Morning. 